So here's how you can reduce iPad storage. So open up the settings, tap on your general section and tap on the storage so you can browse exactly the situation which you're in. And at the top of the list, you can see the graph, which shows you what is taking up the storage. And in order to reduce it, pay attention to what's taking up the most part. It might be the apps, photos most likely, and some other things as well. So below you have everything sorted by size. So if you have some apps which you do not use anymore, you can delete those. Or for example, you can tap on an app and click on offload the app. What offloading means is that it will free up the storage used by the app, but it will keep the documents and the data. So if you decided to re-download it again in the future, you can just keep on continuing where you left, right? So that's very useful. Then another portion of the storage is usually photos, and this can be managed right here as well. You can che check the recently deleted album because that might take a lot of storage. So just delete that. And also inside of the settings, you should have the option to review your large videos, which also take up a huge amount of storage and perhaps delete those if you don't need them. Plus, if you really want to free up the storage and you have a lot of photos, try backing them up to iCloud or Google Photos so the storage can be freed for some other stuff. But if that's basically all that I wanted to share with you, let me know below in the comments if it worked. Most definitely subscribe for the next tutorials like this one, and I'm going to catch you later.